everybody, it's MJ for my paper journey, and I'm back with a quick share video. I hope you all are having a, a great weekend. Um, earlier this morning, I went and got my my second um, vaccination, and um, I started feeling a little bit weird, but then I kind of got over it. Um, Anyways, so then after I got back home, then my husband said, well, it's been a while. Um, do you want to go to uh, stop by the thrift stores? And I said, sure. So we went out to eat. We ate outside. And um, so we had a nice uh, breakfast. And then we went to two different thrift stores. And... Um, so on the first one we stopped by, uh, we didn't find anything. The only thing I found was this uh, two-hole uh, swing line uh, paper punch. And this time I asked the clerk, <laughs> I'm going to move this sign. It looks like it's all, and I, I already um, sanitized everything. I just need to take the tra uh, the price tag off. Um, this time I asked uh, the clerk uh, if I may uh, have a paper so I can test it. Because this one time I bought a set of stamps, letter stamps. And yeah, they didn't work. So when I try to exchange it, because um, I guess the 14, the seven day policy was only for electronics to take it back and you get your money back. But and anything else you don't get your money back so this time i tested it and it worked really really well no problem very smooth so i really like it so yeah for 2.99 and it's a swing line it's a good brand it has a place here for your name and then here's to empty out um the circles that you punch out of your papers so I didn't think it was bad for $2.99. And then we went to our our church uh, thrift store, which is the Southwest Church. And then I found these stickers there for $0.99. Cents. Dream with your heart. Live, love, laughter, and be happy. Dance to be to your own special music keep growing keep dreaming so i thought it was pretty neat for 99 cents um, so i got that and then i found all these paper napkins got for 25 cents i've never seen brown ones like that so this was the only brown, a uh, large napkin they had in brown, but I did find these other ones. These are smaller ones. And then these. And, and I'm looking at them, and they seem to be like super, super thin. Oh, yeah. They're like perfect for decoupage. You don't have to tear any uh, backing off oh wow cool isn't it look you can see through my hand so um i don't know if i have a i have a scrap piece of paper here oh yeah look at how pretty that's gonna look Isn't that pretty so i was i was thrilled with this fine this findings and then I found these were the only ones that were colored this pretty um, uh, green uh, like a cool olive green or something like that and this is like a soft sage green this one looks like it got opened because it, it was inside the ziplock and it's the same uh, that's the brown ones, and then this pink one. Isn't that pretty? 
So I don't know the pink one. Well, I'll check later on. Oh, yeah, this is the other brown one. I'm sorry. I did get two of these large brown ones. And I think there's a small one that I got. Oh, no, it's a different. I thought it was going to be like the same as this one, but it's not. Isn't it pretty? I love these napkins. So, okay, so that's what I got. And then I found these uh, stamps for, for a dollar. And this. These are a pretty good size. These are... I guess they're 9 inches in length. Well, the wood, but the actual stamp is like 8 inches and a quarter. Yeah. So this is like a full-size uh, page that you can stamp the edge of the page. Found that. And then I found this pretty stamp. As you see, for a dollar. And it's brand new. It's... There's no ink residue, nothing whatsoever. Guess whoever gave it up never used it, but I thought it was very pretty. And then look, I was couldn't believe my eyes. The stamp that says uh, postcard, and this one doesn't look used at all. Or maybe hardly ever used it and cleaned it, but it doesn't have any sign of wear, you know, any kind of ink. For a dollar as well and then I found this little doily I got this for 25 cents it looks like somebody embroidered but with regular thread this is not embroidery thread this is just a regular sewing thread this is regular sewing thread unless they only use like a single strand and then I found this. This is a Cookie Lee pendant uh, brooch for a dollar. I thought it'd be pretty uh, to place it in the front of a journal cover. And then I found these um, Christmas ornament by Coca-Cola. Mickey Mouse 75 Years of Fun for uh, 99 cents. I haven't opened it, so I wonder... I think it's a Christmas ornament. I'm not sure exactly. Oh, it's an easel. Oh, and it has a Velcro there to keep it. I thought it was an ornament. How oh, cute is that? Look. Isn't that cute? Seems to... Oh, it has these two holes there. So there's like magnet there. There we go. How cute! And I found two of them. I found one. I said, "Oh, I gave it for my, uh, for my, for my daughter because she's a big uh, Disney fan, and so am I." And then I, in another shelf, I found another one exactly alike. So that I kept looking, and hoping, hoping that I would find another one, but I didn't. There's those two. I'm just grateful that I found that. So I'm thrilled about these uh, Disney ornaments. And then I found this brand new package. Never been opened. It has... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. It's 100% acrylic yarn thread. Got it for $2.99. These are great, like, for needle punch. I used to have a lot of these threads. I forget the company that I used to sell when they first came out, those fabric markers. And they also had needle punch and, and then thread like that. And I think I gave some of those threads to, to my friend um, Dottie many years ago, but then I found these. So I don't know how old they may be, if they're going to break or what. But, you know, for $2.99. And then, I found these um, scrapbook uh, paper for a dollar each. 
Are these pretty? Um, they don't seem like awful thick cardstock, but it's all right. And then the this other pack has love, honor, cherish, happily ever after. Oh, it's a just married. I didn't even pay attention. Special moments, flower girl, yours, forever yours. I just saw the colors and I like the colors. So for a dollar, and then, and I've already disinfected everything. Then I found these huge uh, paper doilies. The package was already open. I think I counted uh, like two, three, four. There's four um, large doilies. They're uh, 12 by 10 inches. Oh no, there's 12 doilies, 10 by 11 and a half inches. Well, they used up eight of them because there's only four in here. So that, you know, for, for 99 cents, I got each piece for 25 cents. That's not bad because they're large ones. See? So I thought that was a good buy, a good find. And then I found some eyelash, eye, eyelash trim for 99 cents and then this eyelash trim for 99 cents dale if you watch this let me know i have your package ready but i haven't sealed it let me know if you like some of this i'll include it and then um this pretty cotton size three uh, yarn, which is thicker than the size 10. But 99 cents. And this was $1.99, but it's a beautiful uh, Bordeaux. This is size 3. It's larger than um, the 10. But that's okay. They're fun yarns. And then I found this for 99 cents. And this one for a dollar ninety nine. But see these specialty yarn, they're anywhere. Oh, see, Harriet yarns. Um, yeah, twelve fifty. This was originally eight sixty. Got it for ninety nine cents. The specialty yarns are expensive. I found this one. And this other one. This is so pretty. For $1.99. But these specialty yarns, they run anywhere between 9 to 15 if not more. Some of them uh, $20. This one was originally $20. This is 100% cotton. And I got it for $1.99. So, yeah. And then I found this uh, linen. Uh, Napkin. It's a pretty large napkin. It's a little stain there. But that's all right. And I got this one for 50 cents. So I may be able to use some of it. You know, and then now they're making those tags. I could use that. I just have to wash this. And then, oh yeah, and then this other yarn. This is 100% wool. This yarn was, uh, I think I saw it was made in Italy. I got it for $1.99. And it's 100% wool. So I like to weave, like, you know, bracelets and stuff. So this is great for that. And, yeah. I have to show you. I got these uh, Lady Antebellum for $1.99. The whole CD. Got Daily Antebellum. I got Adele. I got the greatest hits of Elton John. Oh, here we go. 1970 to 2002. I got these CDs for $1.99 and the greatest hits of Journey and Gloria Stefan. Greatest hits for $1.99. So I can have these uh, in my Jeep. 
because I have a CD player, so it takes and it takes six CDs, so I can put them in there and keep them and play them whenever I feel like listening to music. So yeah, this is my my thrift shopping for today. For the month of February, since I haven't gone shopping to the thrift stores almost a year. So, yeah. So, I was... I'm happy with my finds. So, all right. I hope you all continue to have a wonderful weekend. And that's it. I don't want to take more of your time. And, yeah. I'll see you next video, guys. Bye. Take care. Have a, uh, have a great weekend.